so I've got quite a few tests to get through today. I've got 10 more to do after this one. So we're going to start with this one, which is Concord. And it's a conversion, I believe. And not holding out too much hope. The, um, just even, I will just let you have a look, actually. Just choosing a livery and these horrendous little JPEG BMP, whatever they are. They're just terrible quality, so, and they're all exactly the same, so. If they're not bothered to even take a different shot for each of the liveries, then I don't hold out much hope for the whole thing. I know that might be biased of me, but hey, I'm biased. So, um, we're not going to go with live weather because it's, yeah, night time. But we'll leave it on live weather for now, then when we get in there, we'll change the time. So hopefully it won't crash, and hopefully it will start, and then we can have a look at it. I have done a whole series of tests, and then retested as each of the new variants come out. And unfortunately, it's just because I've got so much to process and so many movies to make from all of the stuff I've, I've recorded. I, uh, as I'm about to release one, or two, or three, or four. I find there's a new version been released, so I don't have to redo it again, so, yeah. It's been a while, because I've done, some of them I've done three times. But they've been re-released, so I've had to redo them again. So this is, um, the other reason I was a bit worried about it was, I don't know if you saw there, it said the endurance was minus something, so. It's already not been able to fly for some hours, for apparently, so it just doesn't make any sense. M minus an hour and it can go for minus two kilometers. So, yeah. Right. What the hell is that? That doesn't sound good. Yeah, we've got no instrument. So it's well, it's a basic conversion from FSX, I guess. And it sounds like engines are already on. Okay, let's change the time and see how we get. That's a shame it's got BOAD as a tail number. I'm pretty sure it should be BOAC after all it is. And it's not even British Airways, it's BOAC, so... That's not very good. And it looks like it needs to be taken out of service by the look of that tail. It's just horrendous. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure that's not how it looks in real life. That's a real shame. It's a little bit too long for the gate. <laughs> Oh, didn't like that. Yep, so that was me switching from in external um, drone camera back to internal view and it just crashed the whole thing. So, as you remember, it crashed because we went to look back from the cockpit again. And I suspect it's because the cockpit might have been inside the airport, the airport buildings. I don't know for sure, but we'll see. Speedbird Charlie Oscar November Charlie Oscar Romeo. So first we're going to change the um, departure runway here. Okay. I have no idea why that's so loud. That's ridiculous. going on. 
yeah, that, that's not good. Yeah, I mean, that's just really... F that is messed up. <laughs> so it appears it's not static as on the runway. I'm not sure what the hell's going on here. But the brakes are full, so... So, see what's happening. We'll just put it in the slow mode for a minute. For a minute. See if we can get it to daytime, probably. Okay, so now we're in daytime mode, and we are in fact at the end of the runway. can't see out of the window. Well, we've got a fake cockpit up ahead. So I have no idea what's going on, but it's definitely not a good version. Really bad. Yes, that's a total fail, and uh, that is a bad model, and it will never be used by me ever again. So, uh, test one, Concord. Uh, as I said, I was going to test them in order of probably going to break and explode. That one is broken and did explode twice, so we'll forget that one and never use it again. 